Hello guys. Uh, today we're gonna be doing uh, we're gonna be doing the SpongeBob SquarePants pixel art, and I've started it. I haven't got it fully done, but I am gonna like start it and build it. I've already started it, even though, but still, I'm just working on filling in like this gap. Um, I'm gonna list off the materials so you can for future planners so you can like build it. The materials will be black concrete, white wool, red wool, stone, wet sponge, yellow concrete powder, stripped spruce wood, brown concrete, light blue terracotta, netherrack, pink wool, red concrete powder, light blue concrete, lime terracotta, melon, and packed ice. It's a lot of materials. But believe me, I'm not even going to show you the Google image because that could be copyright and I don't want to get claimed right now. So, for now, I'm just going to like show you what I get doing. And I've actually started the PNW SD70 M 2 here. So, this is what it looks like so far. I'm going to get it done later. Right now, I'm going to work on the SpongeBob. Because clearly we've got a lot. Remember, like a few days ago, I made that video in Pet, Pet Ranch Simulator, and I did that mini game to 113. Well, I actually got to like 217 in it, but I wasn't recording, sadly, so I can't like upload it. I was gonna try to upload it, but then. I couldn't add to restart. I'm not gonna really explain why right now. I'm working on filling in this giant like shoe. This is the left shoe, and then I'm gonna work on the leg. I know this is gonna be pretty big picks for it. That's why I'm building it on the ground because this is only the shoe. Man, this is going to be huge. This is going to be the biggest pixel art I've done. I haven't even done any pixel art tutorials, so... Yeah. It's not going to have, like, big details. It's just going to be, like, a simple pixel art with, like, a whole bunch of gaps and stuff to fill in. Like, this is only, like, the left shoe. Compared to the whole body, this is hardly anything. Like huge, that's only nothing. So this is gonna be pretty big pixel art. I was it I was worried it was gonna be so big that I just built it on the ground, which I already said. I feel like this stone should be a different material, but we'll leave it at this for now. Yeah, this could be pretty hard to do a tutorial on. The reason my voice is like cracking, I'm all a little groggy, it's getting late. It's already 8 p.m. Yesterday I went to bed around 11. So I was pretty tired. Then I woke up at like 3 a.m. for no reason. Then I woke up again at like 7, stayed up at 7. Then went out shopping again for like another few hours. Like 3 hours I went out again. But yesterday I was out shopping for like so long, maybe like 6 hours I think. I went to a whole bunch of stores and we did again today. Anyway, I'm going to be home for another week. Probably a week. So I'm going to have a lot of time to do uploads. Considering it's my winter break. 
this whole time recording, all I've been doing is filling in the shoe. So I've got all the details and outline done. This tutorial is going to take a long time. That's only that's the only shoe I've got. Like this is gonna be so big, it's gonna be out of my render distance. But I'm still gonna do a tutorial for it because I know you guys are gonna want it so bad. But it could take like months to do a tutorial for, but I honestly don't really care. It's gonna take a long time to build. That's gonna take like months to do a tutorial on. Probably gonna be like 50 parts. Maybe not 50, but like a whole bunch of it. But I'm just gonna. Not the whole thing's gonna be recorded. Maybe just like a bit of it's gonna be recorded building. So don't get all your materials and start building, guys. A lot of it's gonna be off camera. Most of the shoe is off camera. And then I'm gonna work on the leg, which is gonna be pretty dang tall. There's going to be a lot of white on it. Mm -hmm. Okay, shoe's almost done. I'm just going to like fill all this in. Oh, when I fill in huge gaps like this while I'm recording the tutorial, I'm basically just going to like pause. But while I'm like building this, I'm not... Now, once I get to, like, the huge face, I'm going to probably do that huge gap off recording. I mean, I might do a recording. I'm probably only going to, like, use command blocks, but this I'm not going to do command blocks for because it'd be really hard with this outline because you'd get out of the outline and then I wouldn't know how I did things, so I'm just going to fill it in. I could try to do, like, commands for the leg, but I'd rather do blocks. It's not that big, clearly. I start recording just when I need to fill in, so half of this video is probably going to be like filling in. It's going to be probably, I don't know, 20 minutes maybe. I already did like two rail fanning videos on Roblox today. There is a chance I could do another, but yeah, I'm probably going to do another one tomorrow. Not for that, I might not do another one for a while because I'm starting to get bored of that game. I love that game, but I've played it so much. Like, I spent half of my day today even playing it. And the other half doing other things. Actually, and shopping, because I was shopping for another while. Like, three hours. There's three halves. One was shopping, one was doing other things, one was Rising Limited. So much I've played it. In fact, it's almost more than one half, one third, maybe one and a half third. And the half third is other stuff, and then the one third. The last one third is like shopping, I guess. There's a whole bunch of Google images around me too, so I'm not going to like show it or anything. I mean, it's still probably going to count just a little bit when I'm doing the pixel art, but then it's a built pixel art in Minecraft, so it'd be different a bit. Just using the image. So I'm going to go to bed. I'm not going to stay up to like 10.30 playing video games this time. I need to go to bed a little earlier because by the time I got to the last store today I was like so tired okay shoes almost done and it's gonna be good that I do these videos once in a while because you're gonna see how far the Spongebob is getting and then you'll like see what it looks like before I got the tutorial. And then I'll do like the thumbnails of the videos will be how much progress I've got at the end. The, like the thumbnail will be the very end of the video and how much progress I've got. Okay, 
out is this corner. My goodness, this is large. Ah, I can't wait for this to be over so I can do the tutorial. Okay, I'm gonna go over right here now. Fill this part in. Now for this part, there's the white sparkle, so that's like just a little white thing there to look like it's shiny. I make I made sure I added that. I can tell you all what the materials are for. The black concrete is used for like part of his pants and a lot of the outline with the outline of the mouth, outline of the eye, outline of the most of the stuff, except for the very outside of the face and the shoes, part of the pants. The white is used for like the belt or the top of the shirt or whatever, the legs. The eyes and the teeth and the little shoulder parts in his t-shirt. The red wool, there's two reds. The red wool is used for like the sh the, I mean the legs and the, the tie on his pants. Stone is used for like part of the over there on the shoe. Okay, don't feel like in the shoe now. Use the white down, fill these two gaps in. Should have used a different material, but who cares? I certainly agree with that more with the light blue terracotta there. It should have been like, I don't know. Some of the things that I use the least is probably the light blue terracotta, the packed ice. Packed ice is just used for shading. Pink wool is used for like the tongue and the just a bunch of detail underneath his lip. I think it has to do with his lip. I'm not even gonna explain all the details of the pixel art. I'm only gonna explain the ones that are already built now. It's a little weird explaining the ones that I haven't even built yet. Okay, well. Um, my goodness, I should go sleep soon after this video, I should get some sleep after I continue this a little. After this, I'm going to like start like, outlining a bit more, and then I'll stop a bit. After I stop recording, I'm not going to do much off camera, and then I'm just going to leave, maybe, or work on something else. Maybe go to bed, I don't know. I did eat some candy though, so... I have a slight feeling I'm going to have insomnia tonight, again. Okay, part of the leg's done. What we go? The left shoe done, and the left... Bottom of the left leg done. Okay, and this is going to go up a little more. It's going to go up a while. Okay, right? I'm going to say right about here. Let's add like that. And like I said, don't like just copy this from the video because I am doing a bunch off camera, so this is pretty much impossible. There, that's what separates it from the yellow and the white leg, from the sock, I should say, and the actual, like, skin of the leg. Got a lot to tell you about SpongeBob now. Speaking of SpongeBob, um, 
Sadly, the creator Steven Hellenberg died like a year ago, November 2018. Sadly, rip. You created like the best kids TV show ever. Not just kids, any age apparently. This show was my childhood. My right leg's gonna go somewhere over here. I'm just not gonna decide yet. I'll get over to it eventually. Oh yeah, I created a few of the Minecraft block things here as well, but I um, almost built like a lantern bell. I started a campfire, but never finished it. Well, at least we got this part done now. I'm gonna continue this two blocks, maybe. Continue that there. That looks much better now. Now I'm gonna three wide this for another while. Then I'm just gonna cut off right there. And then I'm gonna start the gap with yellow concrete powder for his yellow skin. It's a little bit like not as pure, it's a little bit more drier. But it's this is gonna work. Looks so much better like this too. I'm starting to think I should have used gold block, but this is good. Okay, so a lot of the, a lot of Spongebob's getting done already, and I just started, like, I don't know, 30 minutes ago, I guess. Well, I guess I can call this progress. By the time this video gets, like, 25 minutes long, I might stop recording. <coughs> there we go. I just sneezed. Oh yeah, this is getting good. Great! Well, the left boot's done, left sock's done. Should I do that? Nah, it'll just stay straight. Let's continue like, I don't know, 15 blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, we'll just continue it by that much, and then we'll get to the pants. Maybe we'll start at the pants. Now that I'm getting all this progress done, I'm going to have the tutorials in no time. I wish I knew how to create, like, some kind of membership thing so that you could join as a member. That would be cool, but... Like, we'd actually make, like, money, but... Nah, I would not do that. I'm not, but just an idea. I don't even know how to do that anyway. It'd probably take me a long time to figure out. I don't even know how to edit my videos. So, if I do start a membership, that's not for a really long time. Okay, I'm just going to, like, do this. Now I'm going to... Add two more blocks to that. Now it's Okay, I'm gonna
came up. Yeah. Fill this in with yellow, and then maybe we'll stop for now. Wet sponge is going to be really far up there. Okay. If I do ever show the Google image, hopefully I don't get copyright strike, but I'm not going to risk that. I'm not actually going to do it, but just in case I actually decide to. stop there now guys but we got the left leg done in this part well not really part this isn't a tutorial but like just video I guess you could say I'm gonna stop recording now we'll see you guys in the next video bye